thing. But it's an expectation thing. It doesn't and expectations yeah. need to be clear. Yeah. But it doesn't mean that just because you, you feel that I'm guarded, that I'm not trying to be vulnerable, or I'm or in fact that I am, but it's not to your level of expectation. I think you can't it, be yes. friends with someone like you, you say all the time. Yes. With someone who wants, wants your, your life. life. You're kind of very almost like close to being defeated because I'm like I'm I'm old. Like, when does it become uh, a stable friendship? But as you grow older, you start meeting different people mm. who uh, feed different parts of you. That's so true. not everyone needs to be here. Yeah. <laughs> hey, Amis, welcome back to our channel. If you're new, please go ahead and click the subscribe button down below and hit the notification bell so that you get notified. Every time you upload a new video, basically just subscribe and be amified and be subscribe part of the family. Sweet. Come on. Um. Anyway, today I thought I should talk about something that's very dear to my heart, which is all about vulnerability, especially like in relationships, but specifically yeah. friendships. So if you wanna hear all things of that, um, stick around and let's go. <music> Today, I have a special guest. Uh, do you want to introduce yourself? <laughs> <laughs> Hi, guys. I'm Lukani Somats. What is this? What is this? What is this? What is this? What is Order. Order. Oh, man, man. She made me change my name. But yeah, anyway, no. I'm Lukani Somats. But aren't you glad that you did? I am. Perfect. Amazing. Okay, cool. So, the context of this conversation came from um our conversations on the dms yeah. um and it was speaking on letting your guard down and what it means and um where can it take your relationship especially like fr in, in friendships you know and i think more especially friendships with girls because there's always this context of that there's um competition amongst girls you know there's always that underlying oh but if i tell you this then why uh, what are you going to do with that information or why am i telling you this or having afterthoughts of having um regrets that you had said something to someone and how does it impact that relationship i have a few questions here which i'm going to ask sis here because she came for me and she's like <laughs> girl one thing about you you are very God very guarded <laughs> i'm bonnie and she is so guarded she her guards are like after yeah. all <laughs> And I was just trying to break some of them down. A little bit. <laughs> okay. Cool. The first qu question for you is that: Is there any moment in time you can remember when your walls first went up and what caused it? Um, I think in the context of friendship. Yes. You know, the context of friendship, my walls. I'm, I'm okay. Let me let me first explain mm. explain the type of person I am. I give. Yes. Myself. Yes. You know that, right? Yes. Very open, give myself to people and all of that. Mm. But through um being hurt mm. in friendships and in relationships and whatever, yes. my God definitely went up. Yeah. And I was just like, Nope, no, no more. more. Yeah. Sorry. No more. Yeah. No mm. more. So yeah. that that's when my guards went up. Yeah. When I, I was repeatedly hurt by friends mm. or hurt by situations yeah. that happened with, fri with mm. friends and I was just like no no that's more. it no uh, one in my space I hate you. and I mean yeah. hurt does do that to people yeah. generally like obviously when you know that um man dizao make a sign like up in the shoe shoe why would I do it again if exactly. I normally get burned you know exactly so I think personally for me I was even telling her I think more than anything it's a very Scorpio thing um scorpions are very much to themselves they're very they're very secretive but i don't think i'm secretive i don't think i'm secretive it's you just like to overshare yeah yes that's yeah. what it is that's what it is so beyond that i think on a personal level besides blaming it on astrology or whatever i definitely do think it's also an experience thing as yeah. well for me you know especially with the kind of friendships that i've had in the past where you had to like 
cut the cord and be like, you know what, that's it. Yeah. It hasn't been um, really um, good experiences in that, in that sense. So yeah. I think with all of that, divanising all of it, basically I got to a point where I was just like, you know what, nah, that's it. Yeah, so Were they ever down though? Were, were your guards ever down or it's because you let people in? I let then. people in then. Okay. Yes, you get it. Okay. Yeah. So for me, I wouldn't just go go around having my heart on my sleeve like you do. Yeah. It's a case of if I let you into my space, then you're like, you're that person. I'm almost like I, I'm giving you like the memo to what I do in my life, etc., etc. So now I don't need that memo out in the world. Okay. You know? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Like keep, keep it here. Keep it here. Keep it here. Okay. Basically. Yeah. So I guess it's, it's basically the same thing yeah. in terms of just experiences. It's experiences. Yeah. Definitely. definitely more than or, anything. Or even if you are that person, but experiences make it worse. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. And then what exactly makes you cautious of being vulnerable with people? It's uh, people not understanding me. Mm. I'm very emotional. Mm. Highly, highly, highly. Mm. I'm, a, I'm a cancer. Yeah. That's my star sign. Yeah, yeah. I'm highly emotional, very emotional. Mm -hmm. So, Abanyamandu um, find that really unnecessary mm. and they find it overbearing. Mm. But now, now you i have to carry you like oh, you know mm. so and and this was we enter okay. before you so that makes me um really cautious mm. of being vulnerable with people because you know yeah. and okay. you don't have take, the time take to it. Okay, just keep it moving exactly. i think for me um this one is very personal because i don't like being vulnerable with people <laughs> Why? Um, I don't know. I was really like a friend that yo guys maybe I need therapy because I don't know. Like it's literally always been a thing, even with romantic relationships, but even with friendships as well. It's like as you said, like that can really affect the way how organic a relationship can yeah. can form. It's like but and it's Zenzi, so like I really I I'm really I don't think I don't know if I'm trying not to become this person but i'm definitely not trying not to not be vulnerable is it like that with um outside people or is it like that with your family as well? i think with everyone even your parents yeah definitely <laughs> why so i don't know like it gets to a point where i'm just like i don't like people feeling sorry for me so you see vulnerability as a sign of weakness. And that's the thing I don't. And people always are like, don't worry. Like, it doesn't mean that you're weak. But I don't think it's about weakness. It's just about you. How you're going to be received. Maybe it is about that in terms of perception. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You're afraid that Omyumdu might not um, receive your vulnerability in the way that you want them to. Exactly. So you rather not. Yeah, I rather not. And it's it's or they can use it against you. Definitely <laughs> that. <laughs> oh my god. Definitely I know definitely the latter. Definitely. I think I, I always think that that yo, if I share this, how are you gonna use this in the future? But why is it like this? No, exactly. Right? It feels like a wall. But I think it's a wall with myself because why? Why would I think that the people who I let in, who I can see that they genuine with me, and they being vulnerable with me, why can't I get to that point as well with them? I don't. I'm not saying I'm not completely vulnerable with them, but I'm saying there is definitely some limit to how far I can get. And coming with the fact that when I get vulnerable and then I get people saying, oh, I'm so sorry, like that grace my tears. <laughs> Just don't say you're sorry. But then how do I acknowledge Maybe I don't know, maybe I hear you. I don't know. <laughs> I think you need to work on that. Um, like Man. what I said to you the other day, Bana, you can't have a genuine friendship or relationship with someone mm, or not, yeah. if, you're not if you're not getting vulnerable. to that and i mean like i said to you in my previous romantic relationship i was very very vulnerable i was very very open and the, it was just that one person i felt that like i can completely do that with yeah. and going back to just girls competing against each other yeah go on and go in a competition that 
it's there we can't run away yeah. from it my sin like it's not even lie it's always gonna be there i've always felt that i can do that with my partner then because there's no way that they, they they'll feel like it's a good competition but if it's with maybe a girlfriend it's a case of I'm, i think i'm overthinking that oh if it's a girl and i'm telling her um you know let me make an example like let's say we're both in modeling yeah. yeah there's already that competition of who's getting the jobs then i'm like oh yes i didn't get the job and then you know when it was our voyeur. Yeah. No, you it's not like no. that. No. <laughs> you're not okay. <laughs> no. Oh, you're no, but that but, but, but you can at least tell me that, 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 that people don't. Uh, there's no way that I can think about this, and it doesn't happen. It okay. happens, but abanaba normal. Don't not think like that. that. Okay, maybe I think it's because I've experienced it twice. With, Two friends, two different problems. I think you yeah, can't be yes. friends with someone like you, you say all the time. Yes. With someone who Once wants your life. life. You can. We can have the same thing. Yes. But if but I want not about your life. life. Yes. And, and I've had that experience. So I think it's really stemming from but that. But you pretended like, I think you, you brushed it off a few times. Exactly. And I was like, ah. Uh, but look, uh, you nip it in the bud. Until I, exactly. That's what I told you. But it was never a thing that I would confront it. And it was oh, uh, until now, in this moment, moment where I'm like, hey man, actually, like, I even remember a point in time when I remember I was dressing up, ne? not even dressing up, like, when I'm in the and a friend had come to sleep over. Ati and John, Ati, I'm an Oyama. Good ten umse, like Mulenji, what a good ten umse, like things like that. I'm just like, what, what do you mean? It's traumatized, it's traumatized, it's traumatized. Why are they even in the same? Why? But obviously, at that time, it was, it was not something I was acknowledging that yeah. way. But definitely, I feel like th that experience, literally, Tetayo, yes. is something that I know has happened and some people can definitely relate to. Yeah. Let us know in the comments. And because not all people are normal as you put it in terms of friendships some that, people, some people come with exactly jealousy, jealousy. exactly you agenda you know abandu abandu can be jealous of you got the abends na lendoyenza exactly so like, <laughs> how are you gonna get the car but there's no license for you know what i mean so exactly it's it's jealousy way mm. also i've got reason for jealous imagine like, <laughs> Anyway, let's keep it moving. <laughs> and I was, I was just saying how um, I feel very, very almost like close to being defeated because I'm like I'm, I'm old. Like I shouldn't be having, um, like th these conversations shouldn't be a thing. Like when does it become uh, a stable friendship? But like you know how other people yeah, but one also and and some people really pray for those friendships and they really get them but i'm just like do i have time to be praying at this age do i have time to pray for those relationships because like i said i always even say on my instagram that guys i'm open to to friendships blah 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 yeah. but then again obviously it comes with the walls and unpacking those walls that time all of that time because you want your people there <laughs> also the local as you grow older you start meeting different people mm. who uh feed different parts of you that's so true. not everyone needs to be here, here. they can but if you maybe different to stages me, if, if when it comes to me you know what you're going to talk about with mm, me okay and you know what what side of you i feed then the corner that feeds so a different side of you side. and then that's how you have different a different circle different people for different yes. things if you me let's pray okay ask you what's going on okay you know I mean? so you meet different people they don't necessarily have to be mm. no and i think as we grow older um are you quite you need to have a friend that you see every day yeah yeah, yeah that's true i think we that don't have to see each that. other every day and those are the most beautiful friendships mm. yeah yeah actually yeah i just thought of someone yeah no definitely okay 
and then in terms of going back to the the being cautious about vulnerability yeah. now, how do you generally feel about it is it something you want to change or do you feel like do you feel like it's something that you can change that is it is it still necessary for you to be cautious about your vulnerability um i think i've accepted that i'm a i'm a i'm, a, I'm an emotional person mm. i'm a vulnerable per person mm -hmm. right and instead of fighting it i've embraced it mm. and young wogu the people that get close to me get to enjoy that part okay so yeah well, if you embracing that can i then not embrace the yo i'm struggling with this vulnerability thing and it just seems like it's a i'm stuck but you're not okay with it that's the thing oh yeah now i'm okay with the fact that no actually no now. let me be honest i think i i can be okay with it but it's just I, I think I become not okay with it because of how the people who are actually close and really close to me have a say about it. But it's 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 because it's an issue because it's hindering the relationship, the relationship. to blossom even exactly. more. Exactly. So mm -hmm. that's why you're not okay with yes. it. Yes. But if if you look at it from a different lens, you mm -hmm. can be like, okay, abandu abacha or new people or mm -hmm. new relationships definitely my walls will go up and yes, that's that, yes, on that. and you just need to go through the whole journey mm. in order by now you get to experience hundred before me hundred percent no shame they are over um is it necessary to change if it's hindering your relationships yes but how will i know if it's hindering See, as you must think about when it was up and young, was the fun chomana now, but Uti Uti Uredi Ubane Chomi Uti Chomi Uti 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 yeah. And that that's just part of the process. Mm. But you do need to to give a little. Okay. Give a little. That uh, that's that's my take home from yeah. this. And then what's the cost of having your walls up? Do you feel like the situations are making you miss out on anything in life? Probably. Yeah. A lot. Then, a lot. A lot. No, I think Imagine also, if you, I had my walls up with you and you had your walls up with then me. Then there's nothing. We would have blocked. We would exactly mm. we would have not experienced yeah. the good times we've had together. So. But I think there's also good in having your walls up. But let's not let's not like, No, it is no. good. It it good. Yeah, yeah, well, because Abandu Abandu Z. Abandu was snacks. Hi. People out here. Hey, people out here. Yeah, here. Yeah. And you never know people's intentions. That's the thing. Exactly. About fun. And you have an agenda, and you only want to realize. Oh, so like, that, that's, I think that's the scariest thing for me. It's like if you're there and I have the walls up, okay, sure, not missing out on anything. I don't know your agendas. You could have the agenda. It's not going to affect me because there's a wall. Yeah. The moment you progress and you're here, and now the agenda only comes out while you're here. Imagine feeling. I feel like I've been with this. I've been with this the whole time. But there's a lesson to be learned. Mm. Mm. There's a reason. But how many? Why. How many lessons? Because I feel like you is it different? Like, like, but is it different? There's a lessons that you need to learn from every person. From every person, I guess. But I, like I said, it, for me, it's just being tired that I'm at the stage where I feel like stable relationships should be a thing. Um, and I feel like now my experiences, my bad friendship experiences have gotten me to a point where um, there's this God, there's this wall. Now, I mean, it's definitely a me thing, but DJ, because mm -hmm. of the experiences. But it's like, I also think that we need to, we're at a point when you in this age right? yeah. where you need to clearly define and articulate no matter what type of friendship you, you want, want. From people, mm. what type of relationship you want from people mm. you can't mm. go into a relationship or friendship let's just hang out 
Uh, what you want from them uh, so it's very important to communicate yes. and be able to say this is what i expect from you i think and if yeah. you can meet my expectations sure, all let's well, go. but if you won't and you can't meet mm. my expectations then i can't just demand that. exactly okay exactly. right then i know not to expect okay certain Any, things excellent, from you. Excellent, anyway. and um that's very important because in the same breath way in romantic relationships where you can be like put it you must do that yeah, okay, too. Exactly. Because when I first Even in family, they're the ones. Family. Even with family. You need to be able to articulate to my mom, I this is how I want to be treated. Yeah. 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 Yeah what about friendships that lack vulnerability bothers you the most um it's the fact that i'm giving 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 mm. giving oh, of yeah. myself yeah. and then when uh, you take it in mm. but i never receive from you Ooh. so in fact you are balela but now you're <laughs> overthinking that <laughs> you're overthinking that <laughs> oh, uh, uh, let me tell you I, I think from a person who i feel like that could could potentially happen in the situation nasha it's literally a case of i take i take and that's it like i call money like what and i'm just like i can do that but i don't trust other people i don't think i trust other people to just take literally in the teta in the teta mm -hmm. and just that i always overthink that okay they they use it to some advantage for you you think that if you just giving and i'm not that it, it can come across as that, but already you know yeah. how you would feel most exactly. on your exactly. Then you should find a way yes. to sort of cushion it for me because you already know mm. how you would feel yes. if Omnium was we'll, like we'll that towards that. you, right? Yeah. So you then need to learn to to make Lomd or vulnerable Uwe understand that I'm listening mm. and I hear you mm -hmm. and me not Sharing, sharing doesn't mean a similar what what what, 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 what exactly. doesn't mean but yeah. and the and the over exactly and i'm not acknowledging okay. it, okay. it but you weird in the of of it's like when you're in a relationship you don't want that of course, like, of course. imagine you so giving of yourself yeah huh? now what so if you can't if you don't expect that from a partner mm. or a boyfriend now again how do you how, how would you, you expect that from someone else yeah mm -hmm. and and another question is why are we different in relationships than we are in friendships? Friendships. because shame is the same same. Mm, the same same yeah it's the thing yeah i think yeah because i think i think it touches on my like that that whole competing thing that's yes. the, the example i made earlier on about that it could potentially be a, a competition thing like almost like you're giving out information that you're thinking that um is going to use against you sometime and it's it's not it's not like that oh, 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 that's it's thing. Not. but it's like how do you know like it's like you thinking that umu's like balela what is balela in english yo hmm? <laughs> The, the fact that it's, open, it's the same thing as thinking someone who's, who's, who's going to use it against you sometime. Because why am I giving so much of my vulnerability, but I'm not getting it back? So, okay. That's, that, I get you. You see? It's the same thing. It makes sense. Mm. It makes sense, but... Um, but yeah, not everyone's an enemy. But also, definitely. But also, if you give me 50, it doesn't mean that I must give you 50 as well. It doesn't mean that. In terms of if I'm expecting 50, you must give me 50. How would you equate that? And that going back to that, it's like that 50 50 thing. It's like if I want to tell you that kind of information, if I'm going to tell you, oh, I failed the test, I'm still, there's still some vulnerability to that, right? Yeah. So how do you equate it that we're giving each other 50 50? Exactly. Yeah, well, that's, that's another thing. But it's an expectation thing. It doesn't, and expectations yeah. need to be clear. Yeah. But it doesn't mean that just because you you feel that i'm guarded that i'm not trying to be vulnerable or i'm or in fact that i am but it's not to your level of expectation but what uh, how you grew up and you already told me that it's like yeah. you expect exactly what you told me to be in the same given level of what the experience was but if if you're guarded then how do you expect me to get to know you Did so you you, you also yeah. need to find ways yeah 
uh, to, to, ex to, to sort of make me understand or, or allow me to get to know you. It mm. might not be the same way, 100%. but we, you need to allow me that yes. so that in your own way in your own way i that, think that i think that's you. i think that's the most important thing in the own in, in your own way because i feel like also the level of vulnerabilities that we give off to people um it may not be what they expect but it doesn't mean that they're not there because personally i don't feel like i'm not not being vulnerable yeah I, that's that's no like i do but i just feel like yes it is to a certain level yes compared to what other people do yes right but I need the people around you to be able to understand that it's not even about you. I, I, it's, it's not a you think. It's not you. It's me. It's you. It's me. It's not you. It's, it's me. not you. It's then me. it's your responsibility to say, "Chomi, this is, this how, is I how I am." am. This it's is not you. It's, it's me. me. Yeah. This is how I am. Okay. So, um, any last remarks? Um, getting hurt is part of life. Which, eh, yeah. Getting hurt is part of life. It's part of the process. It's. It is what it, it is. is. So I don't know. Like I don't think we should be going through life, um, sisoika. Yeah. But what the other person is going to do to me, or mm, what they're not going to do to me, because tomorrow's not powerful. guaranteed. But I also to add on to that, I feel like sometimes you don't need to experience something to learn from it. You can take it from if she has learned something i don't have to experience hurt i think we need to move away from the discourse that you need to go through life and yeah. be hurt in order to learn something from it yeah. otherwise that's it from us thank you for watching thank please you. don't forget to subscribe and follow her it's gonna be Lucaniso, followed so of course oh, okay <laughs> <laughs> Lucaniso underscore max. Yeah, yeah. Hope I'm feeling you welcome because I know. I know. Trust it. No. To rain. I know. Chonka. Oh, Yimi. Ah, Nakaes. You could never. Okay. I said, my intro is. I look cute. You do, baby. I'll be there now, now, babe. The pound, the <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. When you can remember when your walls, no, to be a wall with your walls. Yo, I have an infinite question. Oh, I swear. When your walls. Um, <laughs> 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 <laughs>